Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we have an unboxing. Today's unboxing comes to us from Craft Savings. Now I found Craft Savings as another one of those random ads that popped up on Facebook. I had never heard of it. I'm gonna guess it's like a place like Annie Buy and Peggy Buy and CES Deals. So I ordered a few kits because they had a buy two, get one free sale. So I ordered a few kits. I ordered them September 29th. Um, they shipped October 5th, and then I got them October 18th. Yes, you're seeing this video a little late because in my room of madness, I lost my canvases. So I just found them, so here you go. So with that said, we're gonna get into them. Now, I think they're all full drill, but we, you know, we all know when we see these websites, we don't fully pay attention all the time. Your brain gets a little too happy. You just click, click, click. So yeah. So we're going to open these up to see what we got. So hopefully you're having a wonderful day. Okay, if I can get into it. They're packaged well. I can't even get into it. All right. So let me, okay, let's try getting into the other side. There we go. We're making some leeway over here. So if nothing else, they're packaged very well. All right. So the first kit. Oh, it's my little Pikachu kit. All right. And this one says it's a 30 by 30. It's Pikachu, as you can see. Now, I will not be completing this kit. I'm actually going to send this kit off to Patriotic Beauty. Her son also loves Pikachu. And I think that actually looks really, really freaking good. Let's look at the symbol quality, shall we? It only has 16 colors. It's got some weird symbols. It's got the A and E symbol. Those symbols are really clear. But I'm actually going to send this one over to Patriotic Beauty for her son because he loves Pikachu. And since I have the Pikachu one for my son, I'm going to see if she would like this for her son. And if she would, I was going to go ahead and send this one over to her. So there is Pikachu. We're going to leave him the standard toolkit. And we're going to look at the drill. Now this is a round. And I love how they're packaged. First one off the bat. 666. All right, so we got 666 in there. That is a really cute image, and I think it's going to turn out great. Look at the detail that you can already see. Like, you can see the Pokeball back here, the clouds, Pikachu's cute little face. I love it. Look how cute that is. So we have 720, 728, 743, 43, which I'm going to guess is Pikachu himself. 783. I'm going to have to reorder that image because it is just hella cute. 783, 823, 719, oh, oh, the one that tried to get away, 920, 921, 995, again, where were these, these diamonds going? 996, 3371, 3706. Scrambled eggs right there. We got 37.70, 38.23, and 38.54. Now it has this little uh, JSL number, and it says 1924. That's actually the number at the top of the canvas here. It lets you know that these drills go to this canvas. So L 1924. It says it's a 30 by 30, and we're going to check that. So let's see, is it true to size or is that the full canvas area? All right, so that's from blue to blue, that's about 25. So 30 by 30 is the full canvas and not the drilling area. The drilling area is probably gonna be 25 by 25, which is great because again, I think this is gonna be for Patriotic Beauty's son. So I'm going to wrap this up because I do have to go to the mailbox this week. Or by the time you see this, I would have already sent it off. 
So we're going to make sure we put the drills back in here nice and neatly. And then if her son wants, you know, a different image and he doesn't want that one, this is fine because uh, I have no problem doing it. It is adorable. But I will have to order that one again because I do like that one. That's cute. And it only took it 13 days to get here, so that's not bad. All right, so this one is actually bursting from the seams to get out. It's excited. So let's see here. What is the next image? I'm always scared I'm going to cut the canvas, but they have them packed in here so tight. All right, so here's the next one. Oh, it's a little fox. That's right. All right, so we're going to relax this one a little bit because this one's staying here so it can relax. Oh, and I didn't check the, stack, the tacky on that one, but it's, this one's tacky. It's a little fox with a butterfly on its paw. Isn't he cute? He's so cute. So let's measure this one. Is this one a 30 by 40? Because it says it's a 30 by 40. So from blue. 35. So it's going to be 25 by 35. The drilling area is, and then the entire canvas is going to be uh, 30 by 40. So here it is, and we're going to roll it the other way because they use like a poured glue or a mounted glue method on these. So you don't have to worry about bubbles and rivets and stuff on the ones like this, which is why I do like these little companies because you don't really have to worry about bubbles and rivets on them. So there he is in all his cuteness. Look at how cute he is. He's got a little butterfly on his paw. As long as it stays on your paw and away from my eye, we're cool. All right, so we're going to put that right there. It's got your pumpkin spice tool kit. Doesn't have baggies, just has a plate of wax, a pink pen, and the green boat. And then we have our drill. This has 23 colors. It is a round. So let's check it out. Let's see what colors we got. We got 307, 310, 445, 606, 740, 740. Oh, this is a square. For real? Oh, snap. I thought this was a round. Okay, my bad. It's a it's a square. I thought these companies only did round. So that's pretty cool. So let's look at the quality. Oh, we got some trash right there. You see that? You see that drill? You don't typically see a lot of trash in here, but if you look right there, that drill has been deformed. No biggie because the rest of the drills look great. That's just one drill out of a bunch of them. Eight seventeen nine oh six. That's like a grass green. Nine oh seven. Nine oh seven. Nine thirty six. Nine thirty eight. Nine forty six. Thirty seventy eight. And thirty three forty eight. So the drill quality looks pretty good. You're going to have your typical trash like you do with any kit. All kits come with trash at some point. But I'm not seeing a whole lot of knobbly bits or anything like that. So that looks really good. So let's look at this. Oh, we got a couple more. Sorry. We got 3820, 3822. Got a little bit of 3837, some 3864s, and some 5200s. And they look really good. So let's look at the symbol clarity, shall we? Look, there's like a dragonfly right there. The symbols look nice and clear. 
Again, I had never heard of this company before, and I will make sure to link all these canvases down below. Look at that little face. Oh my God. I will make sure to link all the canvases down below. But that is adorable. Oh, those J's are a little light. But because of the color, let's see, did they correspond on the side? Yeah, they correspond on the side here. That should be no biggie. I should be able to make that out. But those symbols are a little light on there. So we're going to clean this one up and pull out the last one. All right. And then the last canvas, again, this was buy two, get one free. So I paid for the fox and I paid for this one, but I got the Pikachu one for free. And again, I'm going to reorder that image because uh, I do want to send that one out to Patriotic Beauty. But I want to get one for myself because that is adorable. Either way. So the last kit is a sailboat. Now, let's see, a pumpkin spice toolkit. It looks to be a round. I just love these kits. And don't worry, I know you guys are probably like, oh, Miss Coffee, we'll never see you work on these. You will see me work on these because I'm gonna start working up some of these snack paintings really soon. I wanna get into some of these smaller paintings because when you're feeling a little burnt out or defeated by diamond painting, you want to essentially work on a smaller kit. Work on something small to get yourself back in the groove of doing it. There it is. All right, so here's the schematic of what it's supposed to look like. And this is what we got. I think it actually looks really good. And this is, I believe, is supposed to be a 30 by 40, which we, are, we know is going to be the canvas area. They go numbers one through nine, then it goes to zero, and then A, F, H, J, K, L, T, U, X, Y, symbol clarity. They're clear. Let's look at these darker symbols. Sometimes those darker symbols come out light. Nope. They're super clear. All right. So there is the sailboat. I love that one. Now these drills are packaged a little bit differently. They do not tell you the DMC so unfortunately when I'm done with this image I will not be keeping these diamonds but it does give you the code that goes on the poo 86 <laughs> poo actually it's p00 but it looks like poo and again this is a round I just love these little snack paintings question of the video have you ever heard of craft savings if you have have you ordered from them how did you like the quality did your image turn out okay i'm really interested to see what one of these looks like worked up and i will be getting to one really soon but i want to finish one of the projects that i'm working on now before i go starting up another project so I'm going to put the drills away for this one, bring all the canvases back out, give you my final thoughts, and then I'll let you go. All right, and there you have it, folks. That is Craft Savings over at craftsavings.com. Um, I think the, image, the images are going to turn out great. Um, this just shows you don't have to spend a whole lot of money to get good quality. They are good quality. They are on the, the oil canvas uh, backs. But that doesn't really matter. Like you're putting it in a frame or you're somehow framing these. So what they're on doesn't matter as long as the drills stick to it. And as long as you're happy with the way the image turns out. Now, again, I was highly shocked to see that this one is a square. So it looks like these other companies, these side companies, as you want to call them, are venturing out into doing square paintings as well instead of just doing rounds. Because when I first started diamond painting, companies like this only ever did rounds. And now they're venturing out into squares, which is pretty cool for all of us square lovers. Because as you guys know, I'm square for life. I do love squares, but I don't, um, I don't mind the occasional round to get me, you know, through that little hump of getting tired of squares. You got to mix things up a little bit. You know, you got to mix them up. Either way. So we have Pikachu. We have this adorable little fox. And then we have the sailboat. Again, I don't think I even paid $30 for all of these. Of course, Miss uh, Editing Leisha will have the information pop up like right over there. So, yes. 
that's all I got for you today. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this unboxing and you want to go check them out, I will link each and every one of these canvases down below. As for me, that's all I have for you today. So if you like this and want to see more random and crazy videos just like this one, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I randomly decide to put up a video. And believe me, it's random. With that said, folks, I'm going to bid you adieu. But not before I remind you, like I always try to. Be kind. Be courteous. Be cool. Bye, guys.